she was adopted uh, and uh, we took delivery of her three, three weeks after uh, she was born, uh, delightfully happy and gorgeous very, little chubby girl. Yeah, I got an urgent phone call to say that she was in hospital and uh, the lass had taken, her carer had taken her hospital for two weeks before that and she had these terrible tummy pains and the hospital said she's pregnant. They said, I'm not pregnant. She had a ruptured appendix. I think that was the, the, the really the, the first mm. indication of things go, not yeah. going well. She wasn't eating as well. She was sick, yeah. eating a lot of food in her own room. We it, couldn't get any help. Help was just not available. Yeah. Her so, doctor, well, she wouldn't go to a doctor, let's face it. But she would never, never recognise or be prepared to discuss her condition. There's very little help. Yeah. I think all hospitals should have at least two people who know how to deal with eating disorders, and there don't seem to be any. Mm. And, and I, I, I feel that the, there is a need for a softer face to the health system, uh, one that's more uh, cooperative and, and uh, designed to help.